Hi everyone! So today I'm going to be doing a review and comparison of the Alice Dujardin dolls and it's the pink and the mint versions. Uh, they are really pretty as a set but maybe you just want one doll so I thought it'd be interesting to put them next to each other and you guys can see the similarities and the differences. So let's start with what they come with. They do come with rabbits, these plushies, and um, the mint version is pink with a green sash and then the pink version is a yellow with a pink sash. So they are the same style, but they do have little difference uh, in the colors, as you guys can see. So they also come with these bowls that are on top of their heads, these, uh, sorry about that, these headbands, as you guys can see, and I'm going to, let me try to remove it from their heads so you guys can see it better. You see what I'm talking about with the hair right here? The choppy hair. I don't know what happened to this pink doll, but um, okay. So as you guys can see, uh, they're the similar style, but just different um, fabrics. So this is the mint versions, and it's the stripes with um, the uh, the polka dots here, and some flowers, and there's the headband underneath right there, and the pink versions is a polka dot with um, some lace here. This one also has some lace here. Uh, but it has these beads here, as you guys can see. But uh, similar flowers, just different colors. And as you can see, it has the headband also. So, it's a similar design, but just different fabrics that were used. And maybe additional detail for the pink. Now let's talk about their outfits. As you guys can see, uh, it is a similar theme, so it is the same style, but just different uh, color fabrics that were used. So as we can see, they come with this separate piece here, um, this kind of ribbon that you tie it around their neck. So the mint version is, these, uh, is a darker brown with polka dots, and the pink version has flowers and it's a lighter brown. So as you guys can see, it's the same style, just different fabrics. The dress underneath, I'm actually going to take out the apron and show you guys because although it looks similar, it's not the same fabric, it's not the same uh, print. So um, they come with these cuffs, as you guys can see, and it matches the color of the apron here. So as you can see, the mint version, she's wearing a pink, there's a pink uh, design here with the flowers. So we have um, pink here on the fabrics, the same fabric as the apron, and then as a detail here is these uh, green polka dots that's also used here as you can see in this patch right here. And then the pink version is a blue color with uh, instead of uh, the same polka dot here you have these flowers which are the same flowers used in her dress right here. But she does have this fabric right here, see, just like she has it with the polka dots. And it's the same fabric as, as in the sash of the bears. Here, I'll show you guys real quick. See, it's the same fabric. So these are the aprons, but as you guys can see, it's a similar design, but different um, fabrics. See, they both have this flower um, detail right here with the bow. But yeah, see? this cuff keeps coming off. Um, but similar um, fa uh, design but different fabrics. They both do have this big bow right here as well. Now down here they do have these um, it's the same kind of uh, stockings. I hope I can show you guys. It's the same kind of stockings they have. But uh, same style shoes but different colors. So the pink, of course, is pink with a uh, darker pink flower. And then the mint is a green with a lighter pink flower on top. Underneath here, let's see. I can show you guys. Because this is part of the dress, so I want to show you guys that later. But the petticoats uh, also have different details. So as you guys can see, of course, uh, the mint has the polka dots here with the black lace on top. And then the pink has the green, uh, I mean the 
brown fabric, which is the same as that um, bow that's tied to her uh, neck right there. And underneath, there's this uh, beautiful kind of cottony fabric here as well. So they do have two layers each, it's just very different fabrics. So now let me take off the apron so you guys can see the dresses underneath. Okay, so this is what they look like without the apron and the petticoats. And um, definitely remove the petticoats first before you remove the apron because otherwise you won't be able to. There's just a lot of ruffles uh, on the bottom. So uh, this is the petticoat and this is mints and this is the pink version. So this is what they look like. And these are the... Uh, the bows that are tied you see again here on the side um, yeah this is mint and this is pink so yeah you just tie it around their necks it's they're separate pieces and here are the aprons and uh, yeah see so this is what they look like and just the closure is by velcro on the back but they're so detailed that on their own they could be dresses they totally could so you can use this on a separate doll if you wanted to. Um, so yeah, so these are the dresses. As you guys can see, uh, this area right here is the same fabric and style. And even the detail also here on the sleeves. And it's a similar uh, style, but the fabrics, even though they look similar, if you look closely, they are different prints. Like this is more, even though they're both flowers, this is more maybe a brighter pink than this one. So as you can see, there's that difference in fabric. And then also here on the bottom, hers is a different type of lace. And there's this pink layer. And hers is just uh, this uh, mint layer. And it's, this material right here is very delicate. So definitely be careful with that. I will include uh, photos at the end so you guys can see what they look like. Uh, so now let's talk about the dolls. Okay, so let's talk about their face up. I hope I'm able, the camera's able to capture these differences because they're so subtle and I'm kind of losing the lighting. Uh, but overall, the face up itself, like the lip area, I would say is very similar, but I think the mint version is just a little less pink than the pink version. See, it looks like she has more pink on her lips. Uh, the blush, I would say, it looks like my mint has more blush than the pink version. I don't know if you guys can, if the camera can capture that. Um, as for the uh, eye makeup, she has definitely more pink. I think the mint version, I'm kind of... Sorry guys, the lighting here is just a little bit dark. Let me see if I can... Yeah, it's just a very subtle pink. You can hardly see it. Uh, the eye color is different. Uh, the mint uh, version, it's more like a purple with the green here, like the teal as the detail. And hers is more of a blue with the teal. So, But the eye chips are similar, just different colors. Uh, the eyelids, both are pink, so it's the same color. And I will include photos of uh, just their faces at the end as well, so you guys can see it up close. Uh, now let's talk about their wigs. Okay, so their wigs obviously have different colors. So the mint version is this minty color and the pink version is a mixture of pink with like, it's like a darker pink, lighter pink, and almost like a creamy color with it. So it's not just straight up pink. There's like different little shades of pink in here. Um, my particular doll, I don't know if maybe it's just this one doll, it seems like her bangs are choppy. I don't know if you guys can see that. But hers is more like smooth and just a softer feel, her wig. And hers feels more like, I don't know, like there's maybe some product in it or something. Um, so the shine is almost like it's a different material. Like this is maybe a softer material, the mint version. Um, I also forgot to show you guys when I was showing their face up. So this is what their eyebrows look like. They do have the same exact eyebrow, I think. Very cute and innocent look. So the quality of the wig, I mean, at least for these, for my dolls that I have here, uh, I prefer the mint uh, wig because it just seems softer and the curls seem a bit looser. Maybe it, and it's precisely because of that and I'll show you guys what I mean. I think it's because the pink might have some product in it. Like this one seems like just softer. Uh, they both do get frizzy as you guys can see if you mess with it. 
But hers, yeah, see how the curls are more, like, see, hers are, like, looser than these right here. Um, so they are about the same length, I believe. Um, but, yeah, I think maybe the pink version seems like she has, might be a fuller wig, I think, than the, than the um, mint version. But overall, I prefer the texture of the mint. It just seems softer to me. Um... So I think that's all. I think that was uh, my comparison. So if I forgot anything, please feel free to ask. They're both available at pullupstyle.com if you're looking for them. She's readily available and she's on pre-order right now as of the recording of this video. Uh, so thank you so much for watching and don't forget to thumbs up for more Alice pull-up dolls if you like Alice. And um, uh, please feel free to leave me a comment down below if you have any questions and I'll see you next time. Ciao!